Mantises prey on a variety of insects, but still, there are some that I refuse to feed my mantises. In this video, I will show you which insects or additional creatures I do not feed my mantises. First on my list are dead insects that you can find outside. Now, this honeybee, as you can see, some ants have already found the body. So it will be the ants' food, and I'm not going to take that away from them. But the reason why I don't feed dead insects to my mantises, well, obviously the mantis prefers live prey, and this bee will not move. Second, I have no idea what caused this bee's death. It could have been some type of bacteria, maybe even a parasite. I don't want to risk my mantis's health by forcing this on the menu. So leave any dead insects you find outside, let the ants take care of them. Number two are beneficial insects. Here's a live honeybee pollinating some flowers, and this whole flower bed was possible thanks to them. They pollinated it, and I have a nice bloom of flowers across the field. Now, I leave bees alone for this purpose. Where'd it go? Here's one right here somewhere, I think. They're flying around, but there's plenty of bees pollinating these flowers, and it's great to leave them alone for this purpose now another to add to this bees are in the order hymenoptera and they have stingers wasps and hornets even have jaws they can defend themselves that's why i choose not to feed these to my mantises because they have a defense mechanism and they're beneficial leave them alone let them do their job they're beneficial insects next we have another beneficial insect Ladybugs, ladybird beetles. There's plenty of them out here feeding on aphids. You see some pupa, some larva all over these plants. Plenty of ladybugs call this place their home. I leave them alone. They take care of the aphid infestations all over these plants. As you can see, there's a bunch of aphids right there. The ladybugs will take care of it. not a beneficial insect but a beneficial crustacean we have pill bugs roly polies isopods you name it they eat decomposing plant and animal matter so it's good to leave them alone you'll find them under bricks pots anything and they'll just be eating the waste that is why they're great decomposers leave them alone do not feed roly poly oly to your mantis this should be quite obvious, but I don't feed mantises to my mantises. Why would I do that? Here we have an L2 mantis nymph eating a moth. The one at the beginning was an L7 mantis nymph feeding on an earwig. I find appropriate food for any nymph size, but I do not feed them to each other. Not even other species. Leave mantises alone if you do not have the feeders for them. That's all I'm going to say. I hope you enjoyed this video where I go through what I don't feed them. If there are any other insects you're curious about, just let me know and I'll reply. Maybe I'll do a part two. Thanks for watching.